15 week ban on nearly all abortions could move closer to becoming a reality. A controversial bill passed by the Florida House now he heads to the uh, state Senate. And on your side, Beth Roussel live for us this morning with a look at what's next. Good morning, Beth. Good morning, Chris and Avery. And this is the first time that the Senate's going to get their hands on this bill. It's headed to their Appropriations Committee this morning. Keep in mind that this did pass through the House just last week, but it had six hours of debate, including many Bay Area lawmakers. No one should be forced to have a child against their will. Period. We fight to protect life at the end, life at the middle, but why not the beginning? So this bill does multiple things, but the most controversial is definitely that 15 week ban on abortion. It restricts abortions two months earlier than what's currently allowed by law. There's no exceptions for rape or incest or human trafficking, only if the mother's life is in danger or the fetus has fatal abnormalities, and both of those have to be approved by two doctors. So how this is going to move forward, like I mentioned, it's on the agenda for the Senate Appropriations Committee this afternoon. Now, if this passes as is through the Senate, then it will go to Governor Ron DeSantis's desk, and he has previously said that he would sign this bill into law. That means it's something we're going to keep a very close eye on for you as we move throughout the day today and as it moves forward in the Senate. We'll have updates for you here on air and on the WFLA app. We're live downtown this morning. Beth Russo, 8 on your side. Thank you, Beth.